I, I think it's it's good to have conversation about methodology. Sure. Um, I'm like, that's good, that's fruitful, let's engage in conversation about that on music, off music. I don't think there's anything wrong with engaging with that on music. Yeah. Um, what I think we start to lose is when it becomes personal attacks. Yeah, that's why. When it becomes slander, yeah. when it becomes yeah. like actual disses. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, so that's that's kind of that's that's kind of like my thing. It's like I don't actually think one side has it all right and another side has it all wrong. You know, I think that you can take pieces from both. You know, like what Shy said, there were some valid things there, mm -hmm. and some of what Ruslan said. There were some valid things there, you know what I mean? And, and I've, I've shared like um, with some of my other label mates, like yo, like, did, like some of that is actually like it's fair to say certain things. Um, but when it becomes personal attacks, when it becomes like yo, I'm just dissing you, like, like I low key don't like you, so I'm just gonna diss I'm you, gonna like, diss you. Yeah, I'm, just, I'm just gonna diss you. Yeah, diss then you. I'm gonna you know maybe kind of flip it and, and say it's something else. Like I'm like I'm not for that. Let's get the people what they want. The Wado Radio Show. DJ Wado here hey. with my brother Esso. Don't know, don't know. Now he's in the U.S. See, yeah. last time we did this, he was he was in transition. I was in it. I was. You yeah, was, was in transition. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's transition, true. It's bro. true. Now you are in the U.S., man. I am, man. I am dropping all this dope music, bro. <laughs> one, off, one after another, man. I know, trying, man. You trying. like all on these Spotify playlists and all that, man. Praise God, man. I tried yeah. to call this man the other day. He was like, "Nah, bro, I don't even got time for you no more." He just straight told me he didn't have time for me no more. I don't know why he's lying. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why you lying. Oh man, how you doing though, man? I'm good, man. I can't complain. Married, stateside, music grind, church grind, all of that. I was telling somebody this the other day that uh, it's a lot of vibes in the music, mm. and I feel like you've always, you've always shared whatever was going on in your life. Yeah, has been a part of the vibe in your music. Yeah, right? yeah, definitely. I think you know, just coming from. Coming from London, where I come, you know, it's very diverse, very eclectic. Sure. So you get different genres of music, get exposed to different genres of music. So when I do like an Afro beat, it doesn't feel abnormal. Just feel I, like, I, 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 hey, I that just song do is that, flames, you know though. what I mean? And when I do a, yeah. I don't know, whatever it is I've been doing. You know, just trying to like yeah. play with different styles. So that's one of the, the, the good things about not releasing an album. You're sure. not feeling confined to like, yo, I got to have a certain sound and then I can write about whatever I want to write about, you know. So Yeah. Yeah man. Do you do you um do you do you feel like you're just gonna kinda continue on this space right now? Um, just kinda put music out. Are you thinking you thinking a project? So I still actually think I feel that like you're gonna wake up one day and, and, and you just you're just gonna be an album, bro. That's what I, I still, feel like. I still feel like albums are important. So yeah. I feel like it just in my opinion, other people may disagree, but I think that you still get to know an artist on a viral Absolutely. body of what Absolutely. you understand what Absolutely. I'm saying. So, no, obviously there'll still be a there'll be a time when I release a project. Um, maybe not in the next few months. Let's see what happens. You sure. know? I might drop something at the end of the. I don't know. I'm I, telling you, I, bro. I we gonna wake up one morning. And this is gonna be an SO project on like 36 Man. Spotify playlists. <laughs> 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 nah, but GP GP. Uh, GB's been working really hard. Actually, like, to, if I'm honest, we have a whole album worth I, of beats. I, I see. I that we can. I, all I need to do is just vocal them, and I can drop a project in the next few weeks. So I can literally do that. But I'm just, I just don't feel like making. I don't know. I don't know. And I feel like the singles thing has just been. It's been good for me. You know, yeah. it's been really good to consistently give my fans music, um, to consistently be trying new things. Try, yeah. oh, this works, or this doesn't work, or okay, that. That's cool, but maybe you could have done it like that. So I'm, you know, I'm enjoying myself as an artist. And for a long time, I forgot that. Like I forgot, like just having fun, like making music, having fun. Like it just, it just wasn't there. It became business. It became like strenuous and stressful. It's like, nah, I just want to be free, not feel like I have to do certain numbers. Even sure. though know, the numbers is is cool by the grace of God. The numbers is um, real cool right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to ask this man for a loan. <laughs> Wait till this next question I ask him right here. <laughs> but I was still... <laughs> yeah, just you know, enjoy enjoying the music, man, and and hopefully you know God is getting all the glory and yeah, just showing that artists like myself, who's not backed by like a big major label, can you know do certain things and you know and the music can speak for itself. You get me? In all seriousness, one of the things you were sharing with me before we went on the camera is that like 
like you're not running from streaming because it's actually been beneficial for oh, you. Oh, bro. To from the, a financial standpoint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're one so, of the few. I, I'm trying to think of another artist that has told me that, bro. I mean, I've had this conversation with a lot of well, guys. A lot of them and, yeah, it's tough. It's tough with a lot yeah. of guys. No, I'm, in, I'm, in, I'm enjoying the streaming game. And, you know, it might be because, you know, playlist placements and. I want to put my hands on, like I, you know, I didn't do anything special to get on get on playlist placements. Like I just made my music, and God maneuvered those things for me. You know, I was literally sitting in my house, and my phone was going off. Like your song is on, your songs plural are on mm. there, 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 and then before you know it, months later, I'm in Spotify, like having conversations with people, playing music. You know what I mean? So it's like, you know, I I saw from early where the music industry was, was going. going. And, I, and then I was not only seeing that from early, I was looking at my analytics, looking at my tune core. And I was seeing where I'm making a lot more money on streaming than I am from singles and albums sold. So it's like, yo, I got to focus on the thing that people are actually clicking to listen to my music. So, you know, other artists may feel a different way about it. But for me, like, I love, I love streaming. Shoot, I stream. Yeah. When's the last time when you put a CD in anything? Nah, bro, I don't even. That definitely didn't happen. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, that definitely didn't happen. Look, I had a girl. I had a girl one time at a show tell me, "I want to buy your CD, but I have nowhere to put it." Wow, that's I, deep. I have nowhere to. That's deep. Put the thing in that's the deep. thing. That's so, deep, like, bro. Cool. Just, she got that aux cord though. She does. So, that's <laughs> so go find me on Spotify, Apple Music, title um, S period O period. Shout out to all the people listening, man. Appreciate you guys. So Love much. it, man. Love yeah, it. Bro. So. You know, I could not not ask you about the elephant in the room mm, right now, yes. which is going on in Christian hip hop. Yes. Um, you know, there's just been a lot of conversation, mm -hmm. you know, on records, off, off records, record, on yeah. Twitter, blogs, all of this different stuff. Yeah. Obviously, one of your label mates, Shylin, mm -hmm. has been involved in it. Yeah. Uh, Ruslan, Haza Keem. It's just, it's been a lot of stuff going oh, on, man. It's been just, a lot, bro. Just your just your general thoughts, man. Like um, some people have said, man, this is horrible for Christian hip hop. This looks bad. Mm -hmm. This whatever. I've I've actually had some people not really a part of Christian hip hop say this is great. Why? Like, Why did they say that? It's made them more interested hmm. in what's going on, in in terms of hearing a different viewpoint. Okay, and just so it wasn't music that drew them. It was the the it was drama. The back and forth. Yeah, it, it was, was the, the back drama. And forth. Is that a, do you think that's a good thing that the drama drew them instead of our content and our and our music? Well, drama is never a good thing, but I will say this: if the drama helps them connect to the other stuff, I'm not saying we should be out here trying to create drama. Mm, that's, that's I don't, fair. you know, yeah, I don't. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm not advocating that at all. But I'm just saying. I mean, the Bible says all things work for the good, mm, bro. Mm. I mean. This could be one of those things. Like I, I've, I've personally seen a lot of conversation mm -hmm. taking place yeah. in this span of time that some of this has happened more okay. so than prior to that. So okay, I mean, because I guess I wasn't privy to like the prior sure. beefs and sure, sure, you know sure, sure, sure. CMR tunnel rat. Like I've just heard yeah. pieces. You yeah. know what I mean? Um, but particularly with this one, well, I'll those say guys this. Guys didn't talk for years. Yeah, yeah. So I'm like, yeah. A part of me is like, is that anyway? Um, what I'll say about this is, you know, like I, I think it's it's good to have conversation about methodology. Sure. Um, I'm like that's good, that's fruitful. Let's engage in conversation about that on music, off music. I don't think there's anything wrong with engaging with that on music. Yeah. Um, what I think we start to lose is when it becomes personal attacks. Yeah, that's why. When it becomes slander. Yeah. When it becomes. Yeah. Like actual disses, yep. you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, so that's that's kind of that's that's kind of like my thing. It's like I don't actually think one side has it all right and another side has it all wrong. You know, I think that you can take pieces from both. You know, like what Shy said, there were some valid things there, mm -hmm. and some of what Ruslan said, there were some valid things there. You know what I mean? And and I've, I've shared like um, with some of my other label mates, like yo, like did, like some of that is actually like it's fair to say certain things. Um, but when it becomes personal attacks, when it becomes like, yo, I'm just dissing you. Like, like I low-key don't like you, so I'm just going to diss you. Gonna like, diss you. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just going to diss you. Gonna then diss I'm going to, you know, maybe kind of flip it and, and say it's something else. Like, I'm like, I'm not for that. You know, I'm, I'm for methodology discussions. I'm against 
slander. But what I am more so for, if you make music, man. Make music. You know, yeah. like make music that yeah. will glorify God and that you know in your heart will will elevate him above everything and everyone. It doesn't have to be one way or another way. You know, you take an artist like myself, like I would think I do both. Um, like I'm, I would give you a walk in the sun, all like when I'm just going in, like I'm lifting up, right, pop, 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 pop. then I'll give you a, what's your name? What's your name? Yep. Yep. But I can exist and do both. Yep. You know? So yep. But you all, you've always done yeah, it. Yeah, no, I've always that's done it. That's the interesting yeah, thing. Yeah, it's like I'm not even <laughs> like I'm not like like I don't even you know what I mean? That's why I like some of these conversations. Even back to the mixtape. Yeah, yeah. I'm like some even, of these conversations, it's like Yeah. For me, like it's never been like, oh, it's one way. Maybe cause I didn't I just didn't come up in that. Yeah. You know, it's one way yeah. right, it's one way wrong. It's like, bro, like I'm married now, like there's certain conversations I'm like, let me let me pen these things, yeah. you know, because I, I understand what that is. Oh, let me, let me. So when all of this was happening, like I was in the studio, like I could mm -hmm. I could have just got busy. I could have, but what I did, I wrote, I wrote, I actually did write a song, but it wasn't about none of this stuff that was happening. It was about me reflecting on where I would be if Christ didn't save me. Wow. Like I was like, rather than. Let me just remove that. Let me reflect on other things. You know what I mean? So that's coming out soon. Um, you know what I mean? So that's that's kind of like my, my perspective, my short perspective. But I think it's good to have conversation. Um, I think it's whack to assume someone's salvation. Yeah. Um, and, you know, and I, 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 yeah, it's just, there's a bunch of things where I'm like, yo, we just have to, we have to do better as believers on both sides, you know? And I think... I think that's the thing. That's the thing. Like both sides need to realize that raw life. We we both need to repent. I tell you. I tell you a quick story. Um, there's a church in London, um, Spurgeon's old church. Okay. And I had oh, a wow. friend. Yeah, yeah. I had a I had a friend who used to, who might might still go there. Used to go there. And obviously, like I'm on I'm on this side of the spectrum. Not Pentecostal. None of that. Like still re reformed, but not waving the reform banner. Yeah. Our worship is totally different to, to Spurgeon's uh, church's style of worship. You know, they have no instruments, really, maybe an organ. Wow. My old church in London, um, I don't know if they still have that now, but they did. My old church in London, you know, the whole gamut. My friend doesn't agree with Christian rap. Mm. Doesn't think that God is honored, mm. being honored in it. Me? Well, no, it's the word I said, my friend. Yeah. Me, I'm like, bro, we're having conversations, we're dialoguing, like, what you mean? You don't think it's true? I flip it and say to him, bro, if you think this is actually true, that means you can't come to my house and eat my food and drink my drink because you think I'm a sinner. Mm. And he paused. Like, if what we're saying is actually, then you can't fellowship with that, bro. But then he had to, I'm like, bro, you would still, be, you would be yeah, straight living it. Yeah, stuff. yeah, but bro, you're still coming to my house to eat my yeah. food. So you must not believe what you say you actually believe. You understand what I'm saying? So I think sometimes, man, it's just people just don't like it, but they mask it and say it's a sin. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah. And, and it's like, I don't think there's anything wrong with having preferences. Oh, facts. There's nothing wrong. We all have it. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? But it's like, when you get to the point where you're like, this is a sin. That's the issue. Ah. Like, I would love, <laughs> I would love for an ecosystem where... I can exist, a Shai can exist, um, a Ruslan can exist, Hazakim, Jason, Timothy Brindle, Trip yep. Lee, KB, Ty, Surf Gang. I, that's that's way it on radio. That's yeah, exactly. on radio. I would love for a for yeah. a, where we can all exist, have yeah. different methodologies, yeah. but our hearts are saying one thing, yeah. Christ supreme, yeah. Christ yeah. above everything. And I and I think at the heart of it, that was shy's heart sure at the heart of it. it's like yo sure. christ is above everything else let's exalt him and make him known more than anything and I, you know I, I, so i think that is important you know I, I haven't had a lot of conversation about this but on my perspective per se but i'll say this man like i have personal preferences mm -hmm. like i, I like I want some Christ in the music. Yeah, all facts. Like, I want to be edified. I want to be, you know what I mean? Like, I want to be encouraged. I even want to be admonished at times. Mm. I want to be challenged. I want that in the music. Mm. But I love what's your name. Hey, you know what I mean? Work. Like, 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 and I've always tried to structure my show and even the ministry such that 
like we can support everybody, bro. Mm. Like if you go all the way back, you look at all them old like we had like probably by the time they see this, we'll be over five hundred podcasts, That's right? Crazy. You go back and you look at all those playlists, bro. Mm. You gonna see Kent Jones. You gonna see Timothy Brindle. You are gonna see Lecrae pre two thousand twelve. Lecrae post two thousand twelve. Mm. You are gonna see Braille pre Humble Beast Braille, mm. right? Mm. You are gonna see shades post- of gray Braille. That's shades of gray Braille. You mm. know what I mean? I remember like, that. You are gonna see all that. You are gonna see Theory has it. You gonna see. So it's 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 like I, I just I don't know, man. I, I just I I feel like. It's cool for us to have this dialogue. Iron sharpens iron. But we got to get to the point where we really, truly are the same team. Yeah. You know what I mean? And it's oh. like the sentiment of that song was amazing. Mm. Shout out to Swoop. Like that was that was a moment, bro. Hmm. But yeah. it's like we not really quite there yet. No. Nah, because not. we got this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But, you know, a lot... But, so what I think some people miss also is they probably haven't seen the Shy interview. That some you people did. haven't. Some people haven't. Like that to me is yeah. probably the best commentary, yeah. public commentary that's free and available because you yeah. can get the commentary of the album. Yeah. But the free and available commentary where he's sharing the heart behind yeah. what he's saying. Yeah. Stuff like we've lost the urgency. That's yep. a fact, though. The, hey, bro, that's we gotta big, put. Bro. We have to put our hands up. But bro, that convicted me. Come on, bro. That <laughs> we actually had a youth conference tomorrow, and part of what I'm talking about is that urgency. Yeah, bro. It's true. We we've lost the urgency. Lost it. Both in the music yeah. and if we're honest, in our lives. In our lives. Yeah, 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 in yeah. Our yeah. In our lives, we've yep. lost the urgency. Yep. Um, it's like. Like when I'm hearing stuff like that, like yo, like when he said Lecrae is not in, like, I think people miss that part. Like yeah. yo, Lecrae is not in sin. That's important yeah, to hear him Massive. say that Massive. because there are tons of people that will say that he is, right, and will be pro shy. Like if yeah. that's even a, like I, so we, like I've seen on Twitter team shy. I'm like, what are we doing right yeah. now? Like what are we? Hey, Paul. What, Paul spoke against that in yeah, First Corinthians. What, what are we doing, man? Don't like, say you follow this guy and this yeah, guy. This, like, we follow are, Christ. What bro. are we doing, man? So we follow Christ. I think there's a lot of stuff that people miss. Um, that because of the controversy, yeah, um, people are missing like the really good. And you and I are are, are mature enough to discern and be like, yeah. bro, like that's a really good piece right there. Well, and we and we this the this the this the other thing too. We consume. A lot of information, mm-hmm. have a lot of conversations yeah, with artists true. and people. A lot of times, the casual fan just may not be able to, mm. may not get to everything. Yeah, it's true. Like right away. Yeah. So it's like you're getting it in pieces. So it's like, you know, we actually put the interview out before the songs came out. Mm, so true. you had some people for a couple hours. They heard the interview mm-hmm. first, then they heard the music. Yeah. Those people, I guarantee you. Probably so have a different totally perspective. different. They have a different perspective. Mm-hmm. You got some people that have just heard the music. Some people maybe have just heard the interview. So it's it's you know yeah. And then some people may have came in when Ruslan dropped his song, mm. then tried to go back and yeah, figure it yeah, out. Yeah, yeah. Or they came in when Hazard King dropped their song yeah. and went back. Or maybe they saw from some others like the crew had a video. Um, uh, the, this kid David has a channel where he kind of talks about mm, stuff. Yeah, yeah, they may yeah, came yeah, in yeah, on yeah. that, so it's, it's, it's you know, it's so different perspectives, man. And yeah. I think, yeah, man. I, I just think we all need to, if if it can happen, ha- take all sit at the table. You know, the people that want to do that and need to do yeah. that, all sit at the table, discuss, but still be able to at the end of it eat food together. That's the key, bro. That's Drink the key. some soft drinks, non alcoholic. You know, because <laughs> I would go <laughs> and still be able to hug and fellowship sure. off them. Sure, sure. I think that, like, we will know them by the love that we have for one. This is what we got to do. We got to sit down and come into the sit down with the purposes of agreeing to disagree and leaving with everyone respecting one another. Mm-hmm. That's We're it. not going to agree. Yeah, that's, that's, that's not happening. Yeah. yeah. But we have, that. Yeah. we have to be it's okay cool. with that. Yeah. We have to be okay with that. It's cool. It's not happening. We have to be okay with that. We have yeah. to be okay with agreeing to disagree, yeah. but still saying, not only saying, but actively doing, yeah. that's my brother. Because yeah. one thing to say, that's my brother. Like, I, like, people throw that word around so, like, easily. Oh, my brother, it's my bro. Like, nah, yeah. GP, that's my brother. That's your brother. 
You understand? Like that's your brother. That's really my brother. Like something. Like we're going. Yeah. He told me, listen, if someone mentions your name, brother, I'm. I'm <laughs> 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 he said, like, what is? <laughs> bro, tell me if someone mentions your name. I'm like, hilarious. Like that's my brother, and hilarious. that it needs to get to that point with but one you, another. So let me say this: I'm not a, I'm not an artist. So one of the things that I've learned from this ordeal is that as artists. And so when someone says your name on a record, mm. almost no, unless it's a shout out. Oh, you you're feeling some type. You taking it as it. Oh yeah. You know what I mean? And it's yeah. like I've I've never had that. I've thankfully, I've never really had that happen to me. I've had yeah. shout outs. Yeah. You know what I mean? And that feels amazing. Yeah. But yeah, especially yeah. as a DJ. I've had, but, you know, I've had. Yeah, yeah. but I, you know. So I said I wasn't gonna talk about it. You got me talking about. It. I mean, it's. I mean. You have to. Talk. It's 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 you know. Then the bottom line is just. Spread Christ, man. Yeah. Like in your life, in your music, at your church, serve. Do what you're doing, man. Yeah. Do what you're doing. Yeah. So, no, that's good, brother. That's yeah, man. that's so good, man. Um, how are you like in the United States, man? Uh, this time you're here, man. Uh, you know. I know we got a lot of stuff going on with our government. Man. Hey. It's not always like this, man. Uh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's cool, man. It's actually uh, it's really good. It's been uh, we you know me and my wife. Shout out to my wife. Uh, we're enjoying it. I think settling in well. Um, traveling a lot more, doing a lot of stuff that I, I was I wouldn't be able to do. Sure, if I was in the UK, that's gotta be amazing. Yeah, that's the, that's probably, that's one yeah. of the main things, man. Like just being able to actually do it to the level that sure. I knew I could do it. Um, so yeah, man, it's been good, man. You know, we've had a few little, you know, Trump fan bumps. You know, um, a few moments of that where it's like, whoa, we didn't expect that. I was gonna say, especially um, in Texas, bro. Yeah, like, yeah, that's... yeah. Like we didn't like literally to the like guys wearing like, like I, got I hate Muslim like or, like wow. on their t shirts and walking in the mall just freely. Like I'm like, wow. yeah, it's a bit too much, you know. Wow. Um, but you know, by by the grace of God, we're still here. We're still grinding. You know, man. One one of the things that I've been trying to better understand because I like I live in the like where I live. There's like nobody supporting Trump where I live. Hmm. You know what I mean? Like. I live in Newark, New Jersey, in the hood. Like, it, it, it's, yeah, yeah, it's it's not my, it's not in my everyday. So one of the things though that I've been trying to do is is better understand, it's particularly when I'm traveling, mm. and I'm you know, is better understand the mentality and the reason why some people have these mm. these ideas and these thoughts. Like yeah. for me, and I think because like I live in a community, man, where it's it's like. It's Muslims in my building. Yeah. It's, you know, it's like I'm seeing, you know, I'm seeing different things. And I'm, I just want to I, I just want to better understand it, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's true. It's true. Trying to trying to get that perspective, understand why they feel that way. Yeah. Yeah. I, I've never really been able to sit and have a conversation with, yeah. you know, someone who yeah. is pro and vote and, you know, stuff yeah. like that. And so, because the, the the immediate things about all oh, that racist, right? You know, the immediate things right. to be like, oh, they're racist, uh, but maybe they are, maybe they're not. Yeah, they, they might be. They I might just want to know yeah. how you arrived at it. Yeah. Like, I had a I had a lady, uh, I had a lady, we're kind of going back and forth on on Twitter, and she listens to my show. She loves it. I don't know if you're watching or listening right now, but how you doing, sis? <laughs> uh, she 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 uh, she was very supportive of the bill that was signed for the transgender hmm. to kind of exclude them from the army. And I'm like, listen, I certainly don't agree with the lifestyle, mm -hmm. but I'm like, fam, like, that's discrimination to me mm. to, to, to tell these individuals mm -hmm. that you can't, mm -hmm. you can't fight in the army. Yeah. Like, just because I don't, I don't agree with your lifestyle, I don't, you know what I mean? No, mm, it's like, true. You know, that's so it's, it's tough, man. It's, it's, so I am just trying to better understand understand, and that's a that's a humble. What's really good about that? That's just a humble position to be in. You get me? Not like yo, I know it all. Not already painting them with yeah. a negative brush. Yeah. Not doing to them what some do to us. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? And you know this. Yeah, America, America's so different to the UK, man. Like what? Like it like in Texas, the right to bear arms. Like all those guys in my yo, church bro. carrying guns hey, in bro. the service. I was gonna like, say, bro, <laughs> the right to bear arms is a whole other level in Texas. Bro. Like just trying to, you know, like yeah, it's like what I what I tell <laughs> Steve, what I tell GP, like stories of like guys just like <laughs> like going back into their car to get their gun and just walk yeah. in, like yeah. GP's like, so what? You guys are gonna die for the gospel? I say, bro, 
if something happens, someone, hey, that's what I, that's what I you know, so yeah. just trying to under, you know, yeah. those type of things, like being black in America, um, but and see, even but see, being African, you know, that's a thing. different thing too. It, it, and it's really a culture thing, because for me, in the inner city, like, we've been taught guns is bad, because yeah. it's like, the drug dealers got guns, yeah, yeah. the gangs got guns, mm-hmm. and it's like, it's shootouts, it's drive-by shootings, like, it's it's not something that, you know what I mean, like, Jody, I think your phone's popping off over here. Jody, you killing, you killing us right now. <laughs> Jody, we was, we was going in right there. We was going in right there. You know, but it's, it's, just, it's a different world, bro. It's I a know, different bro. world, man. I know, man. But, I, you know, I think, uh, yeah, we'll see what will happen, man. We'll see what will happen with us staying in the States and, yeah. you know, and us continue continuing to live here. Definitely. Definitely for at least a couple more years. Like, That's what's up, man. The vibe, man. I like having you in the U.S., my brother. Oh, man, listen. It's good. It's good. I have to pay for that international international call. I can just call you now. I know. I know. I know. We, 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 we was on the Skype. We was doing Old school, bro. Old school. <laughs> Old school Skype. Not even FaceTime, having to do Garage Band, right, gar- right. Garage Band for yeah. you Americans. Sorry, yeah. Garage Band. They was they was mocking me in my church because I said Adidas. Oh, but obviously you gotta say Adidas. Adidas. Wow. And they're like, say that again. I was like, it's, it's Adidas. Like, nah, it's Adidas. I don't know. Well, I mean, it is what it is. It is what That's it is. That's hilarious. Bro. You get me, man. But yeah, man. Appreciate you. Wait on radio. New music coming very soon. Hopefully by the time this comes out, it'll be out, man. July thirty first. Got a new song called No Recess. I don't even know if it's going to end it like that. <laughs> Wait a, wait a, radio, radio.